This video will demonstrate how to connect to the Wavelink system from a mobile device using the Wavelink's mobile application. The Eaton Wavelink's mobile application is available for iOS and Android devices. Download and install the app to the desired device from the App Store or Google Play Store. To connect to a wireless area controller that is still in its factory default configuration, locate the label on the front plate of the controller and take note of the MAC ID. Next, make sure that the mobile device's Wi-Fi has been turned on. On the mobile device, scroll through the Wi-Fi networks and select the network that begins with the word Eaton, followed by the MAC ID that was on the front of the wireless area controller. The last number will be one digit higher than the original MAC ID noted. When prompted, type in the password as it appears on this screen, matching case exactly, and then select the option to join the network. Once the network is connected, open the Wavelink's mobile application. The first time the mobile application opens, it may open in demo mode. In the upper left corner, tap the menu icon and change from demo mode to real-time mode. After a few seconds, the wireless area controller will appear on the screen. Tap the controller to open it for configuration. When prompted to log in, enter the username and password as shown on the screen, matching case exactly. If desired, select the option to save credentials to allow the system to log in automatically the next time the connection is made. Tap the Login button to establish the connection. If login is successful, the application will display the areas that are defined in the wireless area controller. For new installations, a single default area will be displayed, containing the devices paired during construction grouping. The connection to the Wavelink system is complete. The Wavelink's mobile application may now be used to assign devices to specific control areas.